Hi, it's Ashida Andre with the Red Carpet Report, and I'm here at the NAACP Awards Luncheon. So you're nominated. Yes. Yes. I am. Okay. Tell I us am. about your project. Oh, I have a book of poetry. It's called the New Testament, and it's nominated for outstanding literary work in poetry. I'm really I, excited about it too. I'm really glad to be here. This is a huge honor for yeah. me. When I think about all the books that came out this year and that people sat around and made a decision that my book was one of the most outstanding of the year, I, um, I'm just grateful. Did you cry? I didn't cry. <laughs> I didn't cry, but I did do a happy dance. Right, right. Yeah, I did do a couple jumping jacks. Right, right. <laughs> um, so I was, I'm, really, I'm really excited. So this tell is. us about your poetry. Well, uh, I write poetry about what it means to be a citizen in a, and a brother and a lover in a country that uh, often doesn't want your citizenship, your brotherhood, or your love. Uh, and I write poems that try to talk about what it's like to love a country and to live in a country, and yet to know that you're often treated as if you don't belong here. So that'd probably be the best way I could describe my poems. Take us through your creative process when you write poetry. Just really briefly, what inspires you to write your, your, your poetry? You know, it's funny. Um, some of anything can inspire me, but I listen to a lot of old school music, okay. and it helps me out a lot. A lot of Motown, okay. 1960s, uh, Ain't Too Proud to Beg. Oh, okay. comes going to way me. back. Yeah, I'm going, <laughs> yeah, you know, the original Temptations, the original Sim Supremes. I'm just, I like a lot of old school music. I listen to that. I mean, when I'm actually writing, I'm like... I look like some homeless guy <laughs> chanting. I look like, you know, the neighborhood crackhead <laughs> like walking around my house with no clothes. You're so on. in the zone, yeah. is that why? Like I'm just when I'm when I'm writing, you know, I think people have this idea that writing is some sort of a glorious almost Buddhist chant act mm -hmm. when in actuality you have to do it when you can do it. You know, I've been known to pull my car over to get a line down. You know, I I do what I need to do to make the poem happen. So, yeah. So where can we find you on, on, on the internet and social media? Where can we find you so we can discover this beautiful, wonderful, inspiring poetry you got going on over here? <laughs> you can find me at JerichoBrown.com or you can tweet me at, uh, at JerichoBrown. Thank you so much for stopping by. Congratulations again. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. And be sure to watch the NAACP Image Awards February 6th on TV One.